All right, welcome back, it's been a long time. Today I'm going to lather Soap for Hope 2018 from St. Charles Shave. This was made by Wendy and put in the 2018 auction to raise funds for the National Breast Cancer Foundation. I've used it one time before, probably back in 2018, so I'm gonna do it again. I haven't used it in a while. I put a little water on the puck. Might kind of soften it up, but it's already kind of a soft soap. I mean, I can squish my finger down in there. Leave a dent. Uh, but anyway, I'm gonna get this lathered up. I have my brush soaking. Change the camera down so y'all can watch the action. I guess that'd be all right. Gonna shake off just a little water and start loading the brush. The best part, load, load. And when you think, eh, that's probably good. Nope, just load it some more. You can never have too much soap. <clears throat> Looks a little watery so far. So, I'm just going to load more. Actually, not looking too bad. I can tell that the brush is getting really loaded because you could probably tell too the, the lather went from airy to, I don't know what you'd call that, not airy, I don't know. That's probably good right there. So let's take it to the face and see what happens. Let my face a little more, which might add a little more water to the soap. So I wipe it off a little bit. You see me? Whip it up a little bit more, and then start shaving. This looks really good. I normally do a two pass shave, and I'm not the type of guy, as I've said before, that likes to watch people shave. So I'm gonna turn the camera off when I start shaving. Save you all that, but look at look at that right there. That's pretty nice. How it just comes off the skin like cool whip. All right, so I'm gonna get started with the shave. We'll see how it goes. I've got red tip Gillette, or some call it a super speed maybe, with a Dorco blade. I've never seen a wrapper like this from Dorco, so maybe it's maybe I just never used a Dorco, or maybe it's an older older blade by then but if that don't work I'm gonna swap it out to the vintage Wilkinson sword made in England all right be right back first pass in the books it's pretty good I don't know quite how to describe the scent powdery maybe I don't know I'm not good at that uh, but I did swap it out the blade for a Vintage Wilkinson sword. Just wasn't up to my standards, the Dorco. For the second pass, I'm not gonna wet my face. I rinsed it off, towel dried it. I'm just gonna use the soap that's on here without any extra water, because I think that it might, for the second pass anyway, it might make it a little <clears throat> too watery. But anyway, let's go to town. Now 
that might actually be too thick, I don't know. Just dipped it in the, in the sink full of water. And that looks more like the first pass. Now let's see what's left in the brush. Not bad. Not really yogurt consistency. Maybe day-old whipped cream that's been left out to thaw all day, I don't know. Let's put it on the face. Start the second and last pass. You can kind of see on this side where it's starting to dissipate. Go away a little bit. Maybe that was because I put the brush in the water. Got extra water on it. Not enough soap, not enough whipping it up on my FaceTime. I don't know. I don't spend a lot of time trying to analyze these and break it down. It's just shaving. If you don't like it, the way it works, wash it off. Try something else. Try something different, different technique. But I'm going to get this going and see you later. All right. All done. Finished up with... Floyd, that's how I say it, probably saying it wrong. Vigoroso. Mentholado. Mentholated. Whatever. Vigorous. I don't know. Uh, definitely need to clean that off. Gets a little messy. That's all right. All part of fun. Um, I want to mention that I said that the Soap for Hope 2018 was available in the auction. What I mean is the annual uh, memorial, St. Sue Moore Memorial fundraiser on Badger and Blade. Maybe people watching aren't familiar with the auction as I just call it, but that's what it is. Every year on Badger and Blade, that's where that soap was available and where I got it from. Um, overall, excellent shave, excellent soap. I'll use it again, adios.